Yo, what is happening, guys? Welcome back to the Speed Action Channel. Of course, we're back for another reaction. Of course, we are back with another Blackie reaction. Now, today we will be reacting to Pretty Ugly, featuring Blackie and HD Dead Jungle. I've been re I've been suggested this quite a few times, so we are finally, finally getting around to it. I've reacted to a few Blackie songs in the past. I've never reacted to Pretty Ugly or H. Actually, I might have reacted to HD or Pretty Ugly before. I'm not sure, but I don't believe so. But hey, that's what we're going to be reacting to. Dead Jungle today. Of course, before we get into it, as always, hope you all have an amazing day. If you're not supposed to shit the fuck around, start having an amazing day. Always trying to spread positive vibes, entertain, and have fun on this channel. So that's what it's all about. It's all about the fun and the vibes. Now, without further ado, sit back, get your popcorn, enjoy the show, and uh, let's go. Oh, yes, there's no actual music video for this, I found. So I kind of just got the lyric video, you know what I mean? So, you probably won't see the lyric video, I might put the actual logo of the, the thing on screen instead of lyric video, I don't know. But there's no actual music video that I can find. Dead jungle, where cocky niggas get humbled. Gorillas, they fight bad uncle. And killers don't scare my uncles. Yeah, dead jungle, gorillas, they fight bad uncle. Tear muscle, get your head crumbled. If you black, then we all share struggle. Black um, diamonds, the world teach you to love violence. I'm assuming that whatever he was saying there in that verse, he was kind of referring to the hood, the way he was saying dead jungle, that that's, that's basically what, what the hood is like, because every it's kind of like, it's a survival to thing. That's what I'm assuming, because obviously in a jungle, all the animals have to survive, because they will have like people preying on them. I'm assuming he's referring that to the hood, because in the hood, it's a survival fucking thing. You need to survive. Correct me if I'm wrong. But I, I feel like that's what he's trying to get up. I don't know though. 24. Like I say feel free to crack me. Okay. Okay. That part. He said a lot of hood. Really love dying. Loud cries. The guns not silent. So obviously you hear loud cries for loud cries, loud cries for help because obviously people um are are getting killed day in day out. And then but he's saying the gun is silent. And the way I view that is probably the way the gun's silent is people act like they don't hear it because it's such a normal thing. People act like they don't hear it because it's so it's silent. Basically, I'm assuming that that's like like I say. Correct me on anything. If it does have a different meaning, but that's the way I'm interpreting it. I like this flow. <laughs> okay. Um, I like the part where he said, My city feel Gotham because obviously Gotham is Batman and Gotham is like a really shit, like run down city basically with all evil. So he's like, My city feels like Gotham because I feel like that's what it's like. And then that part little there was it. He said, Who do you call when you can't trust the police or the law? Who's involved? Obviously, especially in America. Um, there is a lot of that. There's a lot of police brutality. There's a lot of the, the law being biased. Not every police officer is obviously bad. Not every person in the law is obviously bad. But it's the ones who are bad are usually the ones that stand out more than anything. Because it's easier to acknowledge a negative thing than positive. And when the negative completely outweighs the positive... You know what I mean? So obviously there would be good police officers, good people in that department, but there's not very fucking many. And that's why the, this shit is a conversation, because there's a lot of piece of shit. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I just, I love how I just went on like a little bit of a rant there. <laughs> mind that, mind that. 104. But I like what he's talking about here, and I like the flow of it. Sounds good, but I like what he's talking about as well. Who's involved? You call for help the popo make him booty calls. Who's involved? When duty calls, you know the clue dissolves. They shoot your cough, and your problem never really truly solved. Bless the native youth. Walk on water with some gator shoot. Fuck with you, and we will fight and save with two. Streets are high, you gotta play it cool. You're not a boss if you don't pay your troops. If they kill you, then you made them shoot. I move with the ape or two. The angel like to get the latest shoot. 
Um, there was also another part there whenever he said about the, the police. The fuck was it? Shit. Was I need to want it back? He said something about the clues to solve. Where is it? That That's literally what he said. Where is it? So he said these goons evolved when duty calls. Because obviously uh, officer on duty. So the police. When duty calls you know the clues to solve. Because obviously if you call the police to be like oh this happened. And then a lot of the times they notice where you're from. Or like anything like your skin colour or anything. The clues to solve. As in. To them, they disappear because they can't find the clues. So I, I get that little part there. But we'll go back to 112. <laughs> If they kill you, then you made them shoot. I move with the April 2. They end your life to get the latest shoes. Day junk. When cocky niggas get home. Gorillas, they fight bad numbers. That's it. I like what's being talked about in this song, but I also like the sound of it. Day junk. Gorillas, they fight bad numbers. Tear muscle. Get your head crumbled. If you black, we all shouldn't struggle. SHB, fun to be his cash bulls. I'm sorry. I knew it was nasty coming up whenever I heard. No, sorry. Black, uh, Blackie coming up. I. I I, it's because I just reacted to a nasty sea song. My apologies. But I, I knew it was black coming up whenever I heard, yeah, 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 yeah. Because <laughs> that's always what I hear when in every single one of his songs I love. 144. <laughs> Okay, so obviously he said, I swear there's demons in the heights, so I'm assuming he says that. I swear there's demons in the heights, so whenever you get up top, there's people waiting there to fuck you over because everybody wants to be at the top and they're willing to fuck you over and push you back down to, to stay up there, is what I'm assuming. So. <laughs> Hot on make it like six. Zulu boy made it out. Why not me? I can split a couple bars. Yeah, we ease. You say that there's money there? Let me see. Cause you some clear billy makes it look shin. I said I'm a shooting. He thought that I'm kidding. Police at the school. I'm like, damn, this shit litty. I stay on the move. I can't go out like Jimmy. R.I.P. Wonder why I have no kizzy. That nigga my brody. We used to get busy. Yeah. Don't give a fuck if you feel me. I came from the sewer. Ain't nothing more shitty. Oh, okay. I came from the sewer. Ain't nothing more shitty. That was a nice little verse by Black. Yeah, I'll say that. It was a nice little verse. Gorillas, they fight bare knuckle. Tear muscle, get your head crumbled. If you black, then we all share struggle. I'm in a dead jungle where the feds buckle. Waste lives, yellow tape cuddles. The body suffocate and broad puddles get strapped in. That's let the blood sound rule. Fill your top top. Take the clocks off. Keep the bullets coming. How they get their rocks off. Rocks all over sand with a no spin. It's the plan for the whole land. I wouldn't do because there's no chance for me to alternate a mindset. Alternatives. I do fish for with the proper bait, the proper slate. I want to get them out the mud, but they pay the names without a star shooting. Scars proven. God soothing. I bruising. Consuming one another with the potency we can use as Society in society, there's a battle of ideas that are going on all the time. And unfortunately, we as revolutionaries, we are at the receiving end. My boy, the fight goes on. We won't be there, I won't be there. I've done my part. And I always say, let's leave the generation that comes to shape its own future. I like that little end there. I like that little end there, whatever obviously he's talking about, uh, topic of racism, and he said, it will be here long after I'm gone, long after you're gone, but I've done my part in fighting against it. It's going to be here for a long ass time. He's like, let's just let the generation shape themselves because that's what is going to happen. And hopefully someday it will get resolved. But he's like, it ain't going to be in my time or your time. Like, it's going to be way down the fucking line. Probably never, sadly. But sadly, it probably never will be. But the overall song itself, like I said, I like the I like the idea behind it. I like the way that we're talking about the struggles and like 
having to fight the uphill battle from birth basically and all that so i like the overall thought of the song and the overall concept and the song that was very sick but the overall song itself also sounded very good black had a nice little verse there uh hd had a nice little verse obviously the main person on the song was pretty ugly i actually checked out more of him i really enjoyed his part like i said the whole song was very good good concept sounded good so it ticked all boxes but hey i enjoyed that hope you all enjoyed this if you did smash the like button smash the subscribe button if you haven't yet already as always hope you all are thinking positive test negative hope you all have an amazing day this is another reaction keep suggesting them in the comments or add them to the playlist and without further ado stay safe and i will see you in the next one so uh peace Fearless. 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 Fearless.